Alright, so what's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Uh, it's great to be back. Um, I apologize for being away for so long. Uh, this video, what I wanted to show you was um, how to do uh, how to do fade-ins and fade-outs on uh, Adobe Premiere Pro CC 2017. So let's go ahead and open this. And uh, basically, I already have everything kind of laid out. Like, I have all my layers and everything. But basically what you want to do is, um, let's say this logo right here, the Mellow Sloth logo. Let's say I wanted to fade that in. So go ahead and double-click that. It's already double-clicked. Uh, go to uh, Effect Controls, and I already have it open, but this this right here, Opacity, go ahead and drop that down. You see how it says 100%? That means it's 100% uh, visible right now, but since it's at the um, start, the cursor is at the very start of the logo, like when the logo starts, you want to hit 0, Enter, and then just choose... Um, just choose where you want the logo to be completely visible. So uh, let's just say right here when this layer starts. So you see how it still says 0%? We're going to change that to 100%. So let me just show you real quick. Let me just give you an example. Uh, this, is what we're, this is what we're dealing with right here. See that fade in? Also, let me direct your attention over here to uh, this right here. Watch, watch it as I start the video again. It goes up and up and up. So that's 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 how you do fade ins. Fade outs are really easy too. Fade outs are literally the opposite. So let's keep it 100 right here. Boom, 100. There we go. That's what we're looking for right there. Okay. So I hope you guys saw that. So uh, basically what we did was, um, if you see my cursor, we did 100% at the start of the video. If I can get this out of the way. Here, I'll just use this. So 100% here. I mean, sorry. 0% uh, here. And 100% here. 100% all the way through here. And then from 100%, we go back down to zero. So it's like, it's zero, 100, 100 through the most part of the um, video, and then from 100 back down to zero. So zero, 100, 100, zero. So that's basically how you do fade ins and fade outs. And uh, let's let's give this a let's watch this real quick. Okay, boom, fades in, and then still 100% through the rest of the video and then towards the end of the video it'll start to fade away like a nice gradual fade away or fade out still don't know if I want to do that though but um oh and by the way I didn't I didn't like randomly pick the name mellow sloth it's like it's for it's for a, a different channel I'm working on I uh, got the channel laid out already just coming up with the material for it. So um, that's how you do the fade-ins and fade-outs. I'm going to show you how to do simultaneous uh, or just multiple, um, um, or I guess both uh, simultaneous and multiple um, fade-ins. So see how the background kind of just, it kind of just, just like that in there. Let's do a, um, let's do a nice gradual fade-in, the palm trees and everything. Let's do a nice fade, uh, a nice gradual fade in uh, on the background of palm trees while this is still fading in. So what we're going to do is we're, we're focusing our attention on this middle layer right here now. So uh, go back to effect controls once you've once you've selected uh, this middle one and it's going to say 100. Let's do uh, 0 and we're going to we're going to make this a a longer fade in. Let's go right about here and notice it still says 100. If you don't change it, that means it'll be completely invisible throughout the whole thing. But we're going to change it to 100. Enter. And now we got a fade in of the background right after the logo faded in. So it's like fade in on top of a fade in. Um, enter. Boom, that fades in. 
and the background fades in. So that's how you do that. And it's a longer fade in too, so it's still going just reached 100. So that's basically how you do that. To recap, guys, literally all you do is click on whichever thing you want to fade in. And uh, all you do is just go to go to effect controls. It's right here, effect controls. And uh, at the start of the layer, or at the start of whatever you want to fade in, do zero, and then do 100 um, right after to fade in. The shorter amount of time from the start to 100, um, the faster the fade in will be. And then the um, the longer, like the the longer the um, time is from the start of the video to 100% um, opacity the longer the fade in. Just gotta kinda like play around with it a little bit but that's basically how you do fade ins and fade outs. Let me know down below in the comments if you found this video helpful. Um, also let me know in the comments like just ask me anything um, about um, Adobe Premiere Pro and I will try my hardest to answer your question. Also like this video if you want me to do more of these um, videos, more Adobe Premiere Pro uh, videos. And as always, subscribe to my channel if you're new.